That boy does putty tail anyway. You think any pants behind have a right to look like this? All them boy pick me same thing. If it's them, they'd have to sit down and sew it. I bet they would have been more careful. It's we that don't have no feeling for. They feel the mother only there to work out the sold case for them. But that Mr. Raul go to get the shock of life when I put the blue soap in the tub with the dirty clothes. As for that one, Joshua, I never meet a nastier man in my life. Like he does wear one set of underwear for a month. And when he take it off, he expect me to put my hand in it. So what you just do with it then? I just soak it like I really intend to wash it. Then after two, three days, I throw it in the closet. <laughs> when he asks me, I just tell him, dog, take it. All he does it. I go kill any dog cross foot in this yard again. <laughs> <laughs> All he care about is he drinking. Last week, he come home drunk as fish. Pull out his brand new shoe and peel it. That worthless nigga. That no nothing yet. But he used to get up in the middle of the night and stand up in the middle of the bed and pee all <laughs> over the bed. Imagine me in a deep sleep and feel this hot water splashing all over me. Monkey know what tree to climb. It was me. Oh, Lord. I see TVs that strike a lock. I see she and Ben in the beach talking for hours. I don't know what to think, Glenda. But Ben gonna make a good husband for Teresa. When you see man travel and they come back without woman, is either something wrong with them or they out of fool people get on picnic? When them by studying, they doesn't want to man. It's only work and study, study and work. And then they just want to come back home to their own village to choose a girl to marry and settle down with. I don't know what to think, Glenda. I only want Teresa to be happy. That is all. What is this important news you had for me? You've decided to get a divorce? No. It isn't that. I'm getting a transfer. I'm going back home. I can't go on like this, Yvonne. I'm being torn apart. I thought you loved me. I do. Don't ever doubt that. I loved you. I still love you. I'll always love you. But I have to think of my wife. She's never done me anything. She loves me. She believes in me. She trusts me. If I leave her now, she won't be able to cope and her children will suffer. I have a a God-given responsibility to provide for them. I mean, something like this would destroy them. I see. Don't be like that, Yvonne. I have no one to blame but myself. I knew you were married, but I believe you cared about me. I cared. I still care. But I can't go on like this. I suppose some men could have other women. But I am not that kind. Basically, I suppose I'm a one woman man. I'm sorry, Yvonne. You lied to me, Ansel. You lied. You kept lying. Fooling me. Using me. And I, stupid idiot that I am, couldn't see that. It's not so Don't tall. Touch me, please. 
I don't want to support like this, you know? Goodbye.